Welcome back to Furniture Living Teacher. We are going thrifting today. I am on my way to pick up two guests that are going to be special guests on today's episode. And then we're going to hit up some thrift stores around the Omaha, Nebraska area. So join us and let's see what we can find. Special guest number one. Hello, Nana. Hello, Lauren. And special guest number two. Mom's back with us. Oh, boy. Don't hit your oh, head. That's that all we need. Step <laughs> is nice. Yeah, definitely an upgrade didn't... from Felipe. Yeah, all I could think of was Fernie, and I knew that wasn't right. All right, we arrived at our first destination. We got us three here thrifting today and we are at Goodwill. It's been a while since we've been to this one. It's pretty far out here. So we'll see if they've got anything good. We're all in Chiefs gear because it is Super Bowl Sunday, but we're getting some thrifting in before the big game. Go Chiefs! Go this Chiefs. will, this video will be live after the Super Bowl, so we're we're repping. We're hoping they win. We sure do. <laughs> These are cool. But oh man, they're from at home. They look vintage. They're heavy. Four ninety nine each. Ooh, they out of their minds. That's like a cardboard dresser. Is it? Yeah. And they want 50 bucks for it. This is a cool piece though. It's just made of... Uh, I don't know what it's made of. Like... Plastic. I kind of like this. You do? Yeah. What are you doing? <laughs> I'm doing the spell check. <laughs> so I'm really thinking about grabbing this couch. It's 60. It's like green leather. And then it's got the full base green. It's not in the best, or it's not in like perfect condition, but I think with some furniture salve, it could be cleaned up. You get the scratches out of it and just like revive it. That's what that stuff is made for as a, like, it's made to butter up the drawers and like revive wood, but it's also made to, you know, be on leather and things like that and give it some, give it a drink. So I think it like, might as well risk it. It's only 60, so. Let's try it. Let's grab it. Do you grab it? Grab it. All right, guys, I brought in Neiman to see if he likes the couch. What do you think? $60, green couch. Revive it with um, leather revival salve. Is it comfy? Have you sat in it? Yeah, it's comfy. It's comfy. It's, it's like a green that would work in... I think it would work because it's like an emerald green. Yeah. And even if you weren't able to fully get the salve out of it, or like it refreshed fully, I feel like it just adds to the character. Yeah, and it's vintage, so. Send it. Send it. Good, because I already got the thingy. <laughs> oh, perfect. <laughs>
We got the couch loaded up back there and we're off to the next thrift store. Table, 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 table. No furniture for us today. We can see if they've got any other little goodies. We are so excited to finally be launching a really fun idea, a furniture flipping competition. So what we're gonna be doing is we wanna fly three contestants out to Omaha, Nebraska. We're gonna house you, we're gonna have you in the shop, we're gonna clear this space, and we're gonna put three people in a friendly but a competitive uh, environment. The best part, there's going to be a gigantic award for the first place winner that will be chosen by three special guest judges that we will not be unveiling just yet. So it's going to cost $1. And what is that $1 gonna get you? It's going to get you access to this episode of this furniture flipping competition. You'll also get the opportunity to apply to be a participant within the furniture flipping challenge contest that we're putting on. So open right now. Check out our Patreon from February 19th to the 29th, I think was a leap year. It's going to be a dollar to get access to this, let's call it a pay-per-view episode. Um, and after that, once March hits, it's gonna go up to $5. So now is the time. The first episode will go out March 30th, Easter weekend. Mark your calendars, yeah. Well, Thrift World was a bust. All they had was huge tables, and so now we're at Goodwill again. Another cardboard dresser. Get that. We always need more of these. I can't tell if that's handmade, but it's only two dollars. Very cool. Well, it's not chipped anywhere. Either, right? No. I like that it's got that on the inside. It looks. It looks handmade, but not quite. Oh, here's the match to that other one. Oh my goodness. Mom's rearranging. What are we going to do with you? Let's see if they've got anything today.
Mom rearranges shelves, I rearrange furniture. Just don't know about it as like a, it's like more of a buffet. Correct. Versus like a dresser. Mm -hmm. Good thing we picked up that couch because there's just not a lot uh, furniture still at these places. What I'm hoping is that when it comes springtime that people kind of start doing clean outs and donating a lot of furniture and stuff like that so that uh, there's more inventory. We're either seeing cardboard basically dressers or we're seeing just nothing. So, just, you know, making the rounds. We've got a couple more that we're gonna hit and see if they've got anything. Um, otherwise, the couch is our inventory for now. Surprised at how bu how busy the Goodwills are. It's on a Sunday. Definitely that? very busy. Oh, locked them out. It takes Nana longer to get in the truck than it took us to be in Goodwill. <laughs> hey, she said it, not me. I'm just repeating what she said. Look at her get in into Frankie so easy. <laughs> and mom? <laughs> yeah, I can do it. Easy too? Yeah. Got the little cheater grabber thing. <laughs> the handle? There we go. <laughs> and the step. The step. The step is a lifesaver, right, mom? Yeah. All right, I think we're at our last one here. So wish us luck. <laughs> I think seven is a little much for this. We're dropping off these lovely ladies. Thanks for joining me, Thrifty. Thanks for letting us tag along. We had a great time. And I even found a couple of bargains. Nice. It's always great when Nana comes out with some stuff too. <laughs> Love you. Go Chiefs. <laughs> All right, I'm here at the shop. Time to get the couch loaded or unloaded into the shop here.
time for a haul from our thrifting trip that I did with mom and Nana. It was a lot of fun and although we didn't come out with like too much, we got some pretty good finds for what we did find in my opinion. So of course you guys saw we ended up grabbing this green leather couch from the very first Goodwill that we stopped at and I know I'm sure a lot of you are questioning my decision to buy this. It was only $60 so I feel like it's not that much of a buy-in and then you know it doesn't need that much work but then I'll be able to sell it for I think I'm going to shoot for like that three to four hundred dollar mark so I can get somewhere around 240 to 340 for it again with really not that much work so stay tuned get subscribed this will be a video in the future and I will update you with a um, with an update of if I sell this or not or how long it takes me to sell for for what cost and then a couple of other things that I got was this really pretty and it's like heavy and I'm not sure there's no branding on it so I thought that it was a really cute find it's unique but it's just like a vase that could put some faux flowers in it and then it could be or it could just be styled on a bookshelf or a coffee table something like that I thought that it was really pretty and then I ended up grabbing this like mustard speckled pitcher that has a blue inside and again just a cool unique find not branded it almost looks handmade uh, but I just really liked I just am kind of liking pottery right now and so these couple of things will be available on the website so be sure and check out fournierfurnitureco.com for all of our thrifted finds that um, we're purchasing to then sell off to you guys getting you guys some good deals there so thank you guys so much for watching i hope you had a great time with me mom and nana go chiefs we won the super bowl and we'll see you on the flip side made it what have you got us getting into now